something that excites me, it should excite all of you. How about if you're a high school student going to a school where you get to be given your own laptop and you get to use it in school, you get to use it at home, and you also get to a school where everything is online. And that's what these students with us are experiencing or are going to experience. Lei, hello, welcome to Cabo Bay in LA. And Alice are joining us today on the show along with the assistant principal, Mr. Thomas. Hello and welcome to Cabo Bay in LA. Good afternoon. So this is really the way to go. Last week here on Cabo Bay in LA, we talked to a, a Filipino achiever, technological entrepreneur, and talking about you know how we should really um, concentrate on math and science and technology in order to create, in order to be innovators. Because if we continue to just be service providers, then it doesn't help a nation grow. Correct. And President Obama talked about this in, the state, in his State of the Nation address uh, last year, and we are doing that in this school. Let's talk about the school. Yes, we're using the STEM um, background, which is science, technology, engineering, and math. And we use that uh, model in our BLAST model, which is teaching students how to use science, math, and technology together as they create products and they are actually able to work together uh, in collaborative groups using the technology, the math, and science which uh, is phenomenal and students feel like they're in college because they're able to sit together and they're able to create and design things where they're not just giving textbooks and said here go to this page yes and we are talking about the most technologically advanced public high school in California or in Los Angeles and so if we break down the phrases or the words that I just used most technologically advanced because why is it Lee? Tell us from your own experience as a student. From my own experience actually this is my first time being in a charter school and it's amazing that we get our own laptops because before I've always like just used um, textbooks and everything I, I sometimes you just don't know it. Like, right. You know. Show the laptop and um, then you can this is our laptops. get online. Um, yeah. Uh, and you just work on that. Yeah, we have like each class we have our own folders, mm -hmm. and um, the way we use it is that uh, each teacher tells us what we go to, we got we got to do online. And um, we actually have our own website called achamps.org, mm -hmm. and you go there, and each teacher has their own. Um, each own site where they post up homework and assignments and everything. Right. I hear everything is online. Um, but even the bathroom passes. What's that all about, Alice? <laughs> um, what's it called? This bathroom passes is kind of, this laptop is kind of like your own baby. Like you have to take it everywhere. Uh -huh. You go, um, what's it called? We, they send us an email. It's kind of like a bathroom pass. And then we just like take our bath, uh, our laptop and like go to the bathroom. And then during like nutrition stuff, like we just like, we just like go on like Facebook and stuff. Uh -huh. And then we just kind of like. Wait, hold on a second. If you're in the classroom, usually you're not allowed to get on Facebook. Right. But here in this school, you are? You can? Yes, we can. But then um, students here, they take advantage of it. But mm -hmm. then. Uh, we actually like we sometimes teachers they they let you go on Facebook mm -hmm. and if we're done with all of our tasks and everything but then it's actually really good cuz um, it's all prevented in this computer and it's all like technological okay so. and we saw the logo earlier the Apple logo on the computers we see that there on her computer on on, on, on Alice's computer and so who is making this possible mr. Thomas well, it's part of a big foundation. Uh, uh, Mr. Baxter is one of our uh, board members who is part of a larger group mm -hmm. that is funding this um, innovative high school approach. Mm -hmm. uh, we also have an I-3 grant, which is also working with the STEM program, where we have 14 student technology leaders that will walk around with iPads, and they will be helping all of our students uh, earn a certificate. Wait, and you give them iPads too? Yes. Wow. Okay, so I'm hearing the names Bill and Melinda Gates. What is their involvement in this? They are the ones that are in the forefront of the technology innovation here. Right. And they're working with our alliance uh, schools uh -huh. to basically promote college readiness across our schools and we have three schools that are uh, running this blended instructional model. Okay, so now we got your attention. You go to a school, you get your own laptop, and you may even get your own iPad. And I'm sure you're asking, how do I get into the school? We're going to be talking about that when we return on the show. Don't go away.